Hey friends, Allison here sharing some inspiration with you for Scrapbook Nerd. This weekend we are doing an online crop. It is the Winter Woods online crop and the theme for the crop is Winter Woods. So when I saw this challenge, I knew right away that I needed to use a picture that I snapped on New Year's Day. We were headed out to hang out with some friends at their acreage and the sun was setting and it was just perfect. I decided to go with the challenge for this crop to create a layout that has a positive message, something that is um, inspirational, um, uplifting, encouraging, uh, something along those lines. The reason I chose that um, is for very personal reasons. Um, we received some devastating news New Year's Day um, and that is what inspired this layout. I don't want to go into details because I don't want to trigger anybody but um, it is a very sensitive topic and one that really hit close to home and was completely unexpected. So the theme that I'm running with, you can tell by the title, is always continue. You can probably put two and two together. So um, I'm just, I'm not going to go into details out of consideration for um, those of you that are watching um, that are also dealing with the same issues. <laughs> I know I'm being cryptic, but I just, I don't want to turn anybody off. So, oh, I forgot to mention, I am using Vicky Booten Evergreen and Holly to put this layout together. I'm also using a small piece of pattern paper from the print shop collection. Um, the papers that I'm using are both from the six by eight paper pad and the pattern paper from print shop is slight, uh, is a light blue pattern paper that is just behind the title mat. Um, I used the offset function in Cricut Design Space to create that mat. And then um, the title was created in Cricut Design Space as well. Um, I'm going to supplement that with puffy stickers from the Evergreen and Holly collection, as well as uh, some washi tape from Vicky Booten and kind of a hodgepodge of project products, pardon me, from Vicky Booten um, to, I pulled things, my goodness, from different collections by Vicky Booten to pull this layout together. That is what I was trying to say. It didn't want to come out. So as you can see, I went to one of the puffy sticker sheets. Um, I think these are stickers that I'm using from um, Vicky Booten and threw a uh, gold heart on top of the snowflake at the top of this panel. Um, the Evergreen and Holly pattern paper that I'm using is this brown paper that is in the background of the white mat. You can see that my journaling is typed there as well. I did that on my computer and then printed it at home. My photo was printed at home as well. That measures seven by eight and a quarter inches, so it's an oversized photo. It's going to go directly in my album without a page protector as well as this page as well. So it also measures seven by eight and a quarter inches. Everything is matted to a piece of gray cardstock that has a bare trees image drawn on the back of it in the same color. So it's a tone on tone um, pattern. You will see it at the end of the video that was the starting point for this entire layout um, because I knew what photo I wanted to use. I knew this image was somewhere in my uh, Cricut image library. I had to use it. I did find it eventually. It is a cut file, but I converted it to a draw file and put that in the very background and then pulled things from various Vicky Booten collections to put the rest of the layout together. The title is a combination of draw, so I drew the word always and continue and then layered them over top of each other and then colored it all in with an uh, alcohol marker and then um, 
added the die cut portion on top of it and then washi tape and puffy stickers as well. Another puffy sticker was going down at the bottom there. It is a star. I did use some liquid glue to attach it to the layout so it does not fall off in the future. I also added a phrase down at the bottom there that says never give up um, and that ties into the whole theme of um, staying strong and if you need help don't be afraid to ask. You've done tough things in the past, you can do it again. Just don't give up. Here are the close-ups. Thank you so much for joining me today, friends. I hope this layout inspired you and I hope I've inspired you to play along with the Winter Woods um, online crop. All the information you need will be found in the, de in the description box down below and I hope that you do consider joining us. I will be back again soon with more creative inspiration. Take care, friends. Bye.